As Americans face high inflation and a wobbly stock market, the Biden administration has tried to, po to highlight some of the positive signs for the economy, such as gas prices going down. Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen is also touting progress on reducing the federal budget deficit. Paul Spay checks her claim for PolitiFact. When it comes to balancing the government's checkbook, is the Biden administration setting new records? That's what Treasury Secretary Janet Yellen said the other day on NBC's Meet the Press. Take a look. The administration, for its part, is uh, supplementing those um, yeah. Fed policies with things we can do. We've cut the deficit by a record one and a half trillion dollars okay. this year. First things first, what is the deficit? Well, it's what you get when the federal government spends more money than it takes in through tax collections and other revenue sources. Yellen mentioned that the Biden administration is closing that gap by about $1.5 trillion, and that part is right. In fact, the Congressional Budget Office predicts a deficit of about a trillion dollars this year, which would actually be about $1.7 trillion less than last year's deficit. And that would be the largest one-year reduction in recent decades, as you can see from this chart here. This year's projection is there in red, and then future estimates are here in purple. But experts told us there's one big caveat with Yellen's claim. It ignores the unprecedented amount of government spending during the coronavirus pandemic. So her comment sort of glosses over the fact that last year was one of the big outliers for spending there, and then, of course, big deficits. In fact, this year's deficit of about a trillion dollars isn't all that different from the one in 2019. So someone could just as easily say the Biden administration is overseeing a return to normalcy. This budget expert says that this year's numbers are good news, but that Yellen's quote lacks important context. And that's why the truth meter rates her claim half true. Read the full fact check at WRL.com.